here. A great icon indeed, and she will be supported by her brother, Nene Ajiban. Please put your hands together for Nene Ajiban. The Kintima. And then finally, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Asabi Akropa. is one of the most eminent cultural figures of our time and one of the pioneers in authentic high life in Ghanaian music history. Your string of songs, and which is an intimate and carefully created collection of your thoughts and creativity that spans the beginning of your career to present day are very much adored. Perfect for the world who may be new, to your artistic accomplishments as well as your long-time fans, now, the volume of your music explores depth, breadth, and magnitude of one of the continent's most astonishing bodies of work. Your commitment to the expansion and improvement of our heritage through your music remains unshaken even as the generations change. Your music became a profound cornerstone of our national pride as you spoke that dream and help propel unity and dignity and quality in Ghanaian music. In recognition and in appreciation of an exceptional performance and contribution to the music industry in Ghana, the Executive Committee of Rhythms on the Runway present to you the citation of honor as the Queen of High Life. Ladies and gentlemen, let's pay our respects to Queen Asabia Koppa. Shall we all say Jehovah is good? I'd like to dedicate this special award to somebody special to me in my life and in my career. But before that, I'd like to say a very big thanks to Mr. K.O.D., one of Africa's hardest working men in showbiz and his 1957 team. Thank you, beloved minister, Auntie Barbara, and your royal entourage. Kudimi, honey, oh, Kudimi. Kudimi, Kudimi. Kudimi, oh, you say Kudimi. How are you? Thank you. That's how my grandma says good evening. How are you, Kudimi, oh? Also, I want to remember my mother in music. La Grande Imperatrice de la Chanson Africaine, Miriam Zenzi Makiba. Thank you. In the Last but not least, is my king to my brother, my big brother, He taught me everything in music, everything, and he brought the king to concept. I remember the day when he said in our language, our Kluge, our proper language, he said, Meaning what? I go to mom and ball her kente. That's my auntie Asabia Kropa. And the brother also go to the father and ball 
is Kenti. No, my man, no, my child, no, my uncle, so we did, and we took the king to, to Cote d'Ivoire in 1983. When our country, Ghana, was challenged, we represented our country. And Cote d'Ivoire came out with the painted print, which is moving like a spirit today in the whole wide world. We thank our forefathers, our forebears, our ancestors, Nene Minio Made. Thank you. I'm proud of you. And I want to take this opportunity to thank our ancestors who brought everything concerning Kenti. This one, to find the Kenti concept. Kenti has different colors. The colors represent all of us different The designs represent our individual characteristics. Our ancestors were able to weave all this into one cloth, meaning we are all one people. 